I want to uh, enumerate the ideals of our founders and compare where we stand today. So uh, uh, the opening ideal of our monetary system was that of a gold standard, of the classical gold standard, which had ended as so much else uh, did of life in the Edwardian age in 1914. Uh, but the founders of the Fed didn't know there was a world war coming. They believed in the efficacy and the elegance and the simplicity of the gold standard, as some of us aging financial writers still do. And that was their idea, a gold standard. Well, today we have a PhD standard. Um, the founders of the Fed believed in the institution of central banking. Now, a central bank does not create credit, it rather intermediates credit. It, 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 it liquefies uh, good assets uh, that are temporarily illiquid. Uh, we have evolved uh, from a central banking, I submit to you, uh, to, uh, to a species of central planning uh, in which our PhDs um, no longer uh, uh, leave it to the central banks to, to liquefy assets. No, they create credit. They absorb government securities and materialize money that didn't exist, and, uh, and they do this in the interest of, of influencing macroeconomic outcomes. So they're no longer central bankers in the classical sense. They are central planners. Um, we have, additionally, um, morphed from a regime in finance of individual responsibility to one of collective responsibility. Um, now, I have my office on 2 Wall Street. I have been occupied. Um, uh, the people doing the occupation um, have, I think, one good point. I, I don't believe in many of the good points that they say are good, but I, I do concede with them uh, that all too often in the modern age, it is the capitalists who get the upside, whereas we, the people, get to participate in the downside. Uh, that was not the, the idea or the ideal of the founders of the Fed. Um, uh, there has come tragically, in my view, tragically for the future of capitalism, a great wedge between those who take risk and those who bear risk. Uh, 